Avalon, I would say, is the first proper gated community in, in Bucharest and in Romania. A gated community is a private community um, where you exercise a lot of control over what happens on the interior. And it's a concept you find usually in the United Kingdom, in the US, also in South Africa, where I'm from. Um, and what we did is we took that concept and adapted it for Romanian, uh, for Romanian landscape. We wanted to do something truly unique. Have large open green areas, low density buildings with beautiful architecture where we could create a community that is a space for 800 families, couples that are like-minded, that are looking for the same quality things in life and just living in a, in a very good environment that's very well designed. So a gatehouse is quite literally from medieval times, a fortified gateway or entrance. And since uh, Avalon is a gated community, we wanted to build something that would be a proper destination, a place of arrival. And uh, we decided to build something that will also have multiple purposes. It's an entry point, um, quite literally, you know, from an administrative point of view. This is where you will enter, where your guests will sign in. But it will also serve other purposes uh, that make sense uh, in today's modern world, where you would have concierge services to uh, take deliveries for you during the day. But then you would also have all these wonderful open spaces and you see there's quite a big gallery space uh, open. Um, so the gatehouse in the long term will then also become a social hub. Um, at the top floor you have space where you can have private parties, uh, cocktails in the evenings, uh, wine tastings, exhibitions. Um, we don't want to be too prescriptive as to what the space would be used for because that will really be determined by this community. So it's just another one of many common areas and common spaces that will be available to the Avalon community. I mean, you could literally, quite literally, then do anything in the spaces. You could even have a yoga class here, right? You could have a morning tea. You could have uh, wine and cheese on the top floor. Uh, uh, you can have, conduct business meetings here. You could have little conferences. You, know, you can spend this whole time and you, know, you could even get the acoustics right and have somebody playing piano here. And that's what I love about it. As a developer, I think our responsibility is to try and anticipate the future, but to give you our buyers and the people who would live here the flexibility to kind of write their own story. And, and I think this is a space where, where they can do such a thing. I think the effort of developers today is to really focus on community, communal spaces. Uh, the gatehouse is one of many such spaces in Avalon. Um, and I think that's what makes it unique is we, when you, when you think of Avalon and when you're interested to buy an Avalon and for those people who have bought here, I think the appealing is the units are fantastic, but it is all the additional things that comes with it that really is something that you take ownership of in as well. You know, it's like a shared community, a shared space. And I think that is what makes it extremely unique and, and pleasant. I think it's important for people to be able to have a feeling of ownership, have a feeling of pride. You know, I know for certain I'll be living in Avalon and for me it, it's lovely the idea to think that this is a space that I also feel is my own space, where my guests will arrive, where you know, I could have a private meeting. I think that is what makes it unique. Absolutely, I think it's a it's a huge investment. I mean, obviously financially, it's uh, there's the financial aspect of it, but it's about the long-term benefits that uh, residents at Avalon will get from from this building. Absolutely, our focus is is definitely to be always community focused. So on each and every project that we have in development. There is a sim similar concept, and in Marmara we have a community centre. Um, at Avalon we have, happen to have the gatehouse, which as I mentioned I think is, is a similar feature as like the community centre but uh, in Marmara. But what makes a difference is because this is a gated community, it's a private community, uh, Marmara the, is more open space, so it's, uh, it's, it, there's lots more public spaces, so then the community centre in itself 
becomes the private space within the buildings. At Avalon we also have the clubhouse, um, which is also an exclusive uh, area for restaurants, gyms, fitness that will be utilised. So definitely in any other projects that we will develop where we have gated communities, this will be a feature for sure in the future. And in any other projects that we develop, which is more public open green spaces like at Silk District and Playardis and Marmara and many other projects in the pipeline, you will always find community centres with, with these flexibility in use for the community.